Audio Jungle. News, national by staff reporter former Vice President Felix L. M. Fokos woes continue to mount with workers at Choppy's supermarket where he is a shareholder saying they are subjected to deplorable working conditions and have called for the immediate intervention of the authorities. The workers are accusing the management of unfair dismissals, victimization, poor salaries and non-payment of overtime and have threatened to demonstrate against the multi-million franchise if their plight is not addressed soon. The workers, through their workers' union, have since sent an open letter to President Emerson Mnangagwa, seeking immediate intervention. The workers accused Mr. Mfoko of hiring people of Asian origin and placing them in managerial positions at the expense of local and qualified staff. The accusations come at a time when the former VP is facing a string of allegations and lawsuits among them from a local confectionery company. The confectionery company is suing Mr. Mfoko for $2,1 million for loss of business. Choppies has about 32 shops countrywide. Reads part of the letter, since Choppies T.A. Nanivat's investments came here in Zimbabwe around 2013 with the former Vice President P. Mfoko he took us from our previous employers, which is good, now the problem is that he hired his cruel suppressive and racist managers. Truly they don't respect any black person. My question is that if this business is Mr. Mfoko's why is he hiring managers from as far as India while we have unemployment problems in our country? What exactly are these guys doing that we are not capable of doing? To be honest as Choppy's workers. We are slaves in our own land but we don't have anywhere to go since the former VP is being used as a tool to suppress us. The workers said they once requested for the payment of their overtime but they were threatened with dismissal. Since we mentioned before that we were taken from our previous employer Mr. Raj Modi we agreed with Choppies that our services and benefits will be continuous but all the old staff are being fired unfairly to avoid paying for their services and benefits. We appeal to your honorable office so that the slavery that is being currently practiced by Choppies can be immediately stopped and all those who lost their jobs be recalled or at least fairly paid for their services.